Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you the 25 books that I mainly want to read in 2022. Now I was going to show you all the books that I want to read but we'd be here for a long time so I thought why not make it 22 books, uh, 25 sorry. So let's get right into this video because it might be a long one depending on how long it takes me to like explain stuff to you so let's get right in into it okay so the first one that i really want to read is the cheat sheet by sarah adams this is apparently a friends to lovers romance and um the girl i think her name's brie um she is a ballerina and the boy which i think his name's aiden i could be wrong um he's a footballer i think or he does some kind of like sports um and apparently like from what i've like heard brie can't do like ballerina as like good as she used to because there's some kind of injury i don't know but all I know is it's friends to lovers, um, that they've been friends since high school, and that's all I know. So, yeah, I really want to read this. I was hoping to read it last year, but I never actually got around to it, so I'm glad that I'm hopefully going to get it this year. I'm also hoping to read it this month, January, so... The next one I really want to read is Luna and the Lie by Mara Sparta. Um, again, I don't know much about this except for it's about, like, I think she, like, paints cars and welds them and stuff like that. And that's all I know. Oh, and except for, like, it's Grumpy Sunshine, I think, where he's grumpy and she's, like, sunshine. Um, enemies to lovers, I suppose. But, yeah. That's all I know really about it um, is what she does as a job and what trope it is. But that's all I know and again I'm hoping to read it in January because I also have been meaning to read this since last year and I just never got around to it so you know I'm hoping to do that. The next one I'm hoping to read is Verity by Colleen Hoover. Um, I've heard this is like a um, thriller and with a bit of romance um and i have also heard that it's very terrifying so i don't know anything about this book at all except for it's scary so i can't really tell you much about it but i can't wait to read it i was thinking about reading it this month but i'm not sure i will see how i feel um because at the moment I've kind of, I was following my TBR and then I kind of just went off track with it, so. The next thing I want to read, this is a series, it's the Voyeur series. So you have Voyeur, Lovers, Saviour, Another, Liar and Teacher. Um, I want to read all of those books um, because I've heard that they're so good. More to Mary, I watched her video and she said that her favourite were the favorite was another and apparently it's a surprise pregnancy i know that voyeur is teacher student lovers is mmf and mm um and then i'm not sure what savior and liar is but then teacher is i don't know like the full plot but basically where the guy teaches the girl something but i can't remember and i'm pretty sure the girl has some kind of trauma but i can't remember like, well not remember but i don't know what um he's helping her with basically the next one i really want to read is no tomorrow by karen cole i don't know anything about this except for i have heard from quite a lot of people that is really good um so yeah there's not much to say about that but all i know is i really want to read it again i was i was wanting to read it last year never got around to it so Let's hope we can do it this year. And it is on my January TBR. So I'm hoping to do it in January. Next one is Happily Ever After by V. Killen and Penelope Ward. Um, I love V. Killen and Pen Penelope Ward's writing together and separately. Um, I think they're both great authors. Um, so I really want to read it. Um, I've, heard, I've loved both of their stuff. 
like always have um but i've heard that happily ever a letter after is like very good so i want to read that the next one i really want to read is the seven husbands of evelyn hugo by taylor jenkins reed um now if you haven't heard of this book i don't know where you have been might have been living under a rock i don't know <laughs> but i'd like to know where have you been because everyone hypes this book up so much says it's so good it's everywhere on booktube booktop bookstagram everywhere you will see it everywhere um and i haven't got a chance to read it i was supposed to read it last year like most of the other books never got around to it so i'm hoping to do it this month but yeah so i've heard obviously that's really good because it's been really hyped and i'm hoping to get to it this month but i don't know if i will next one i want to read is daisy jones and the six by taylor jenkins read as well again with some of the uh, husbands of evelyn hugo where have you been have you been living under a rock <laughs> i don't know but this has also been hyped up as much as the seven husbands of evelyn hugo and so i want to read it as bad i don't know if i'll read it this month but hopefully next month but it's so good apparently the next one i want to read is a touch of darkness by scarlet st clair um i've had i don't know anything about this um but all i've heard is that it's good so i really want to read that i want to read it in december but never got around to it i also want to read it in november and never got around to it so the next one i want to read is confessed by colleen hoover i've heard that this is really good as well and just because colleen hoover i want to read it um again i don't know anything about this except for i think she no he owns an art gallery that like he gets people to write their secrets and he'll paint them and then sell them i think that's really cool um i think that's what it's about anyway sort of along those lines but yeah i hope that's really good and i can't wait to read it next one i want to read is all you perfects by colin hoover um again i've heard that this is really good everyone's having it up and obviously because it's colin hoover like what um so i've heard that this is about a marriage that where they're struggling they're kind of like falling apart um I, I don't know if it's like a second chance romance i don't really know what happens but that's all i know about it so i really want to read that i'm hoping to do it this month but i don't know the next book I want to read is Bunny by Mona Award. Award. Um, I've heard books with Chloe go on about this book so much. Um, and she said that it's so good. She loves it. And so I, I really want to read it. The next one I want to read is Forget Me Not by QB Tyler. Um, I've heard that this book is great. I've heard that it's about um, this guy. He loses his memory. But he was like really horrible like before he lost his memory he was like really horrible to the girl i don't know their name so i'm just gonna say yeah um he's really horrible to his girlfriend basically um he's not like very nice i don't think he was there a lot you know stuff like that so they broke up oh or did they divorce was he married i'm not sure either way um they split up he lost his memory and he still thinks that they're together and he doesn't remember anything that he did and so obviously the woman she's like what do i do in this situation what am i supposed to do um but yeah it it can be very hard to read i suppose i would check the trigger ones because i'm not quite sure what it's about but yeah next one i really want to read is red white Roy and royal blue by casey mccriston i have heard that this is really good as well this was hyped up at the beginning of 2021 i believe uh where everyone was reading it and saying that it's really good and whatever um i don't know much about it except for i'm pretty sure it's like one of them's like a prince no i think but um i don't i don't 
physically know what's going on. I'm pretty sure that it's like um LGBTQ plus book. But yeah, I don't really know much about it. Um, except for apparently it's good. So next one I wanna read is Hush Hush by Lucia Franco. Again, her that's really good. Um and so I really wanna read it. I do own it. So I'm hoping to read it this month, but I don't know. Um we'll see we'll see what happens i don't know anything about it um but i want to read it so <laughs> the next one i want to read is the doctor by nikki sloan i've been me meaning to read this for a long time i just haven't got around to it but i'm hoping to do it very very soon like early in the year um i don't know anything about this book i've just heard that it's really good it was hyped up for a little bit and so yeah, i'm hoping to read it Next one I want to read is Reminders of Him by Colleen Hoover. This is her newest release. It came out on the 18th of January. Um, and, oh my god. I've already heard that everyone loves this so much. Like, everyone on Instagram, like, especially. Like, it's getting so much hype. And I'm not surprised because, come on, it's Colleen Hoover. Um, but, yeah, so I really want to read that. Next book I want to read is Priest by Sierra Simone. Um, again, heard that this is really good. It's also a series, I think. So it's also got Sinner and Saint. I think Sinner's the second, Saint's the third. Um, and I've heard that they're all really good. But I'm ho hoping to read Priest very soon. So next one I want to read is. But uh, it's a series, but I'm going to class it all as like different books because they are. Is Balance, Execution, Release, Twist and Dismount by Lucia Franco. Um, this is a romance, obviously. But apparently, like, she dates a coach? I think. I could be so wrong about that, but I'm pretty sure that's what I heard. Um and i got this recommendation from mortimer mary no surprise um but these books are so expensive like it's like 20 pound for each book so i got it on my kindle for i think it was like 2.99 each or something like that um Still isn't cheap for my Kindle, but a lot cheaper. I'm hoping to get the copies one day. But it's not like I just have like a spare hundred pound to get all of them. You know? <laughs> I ain't that great. So I'm hoping to get them soon or one day. But I've got them on my Kindle, so at least I can still read them. Okay, that is the end of this video. I really hope you enjoyed. If you did, please like and subscribe. And I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.